Alrighty, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of EDB Outdoors. Boy, does it feel good to say that intro. It's been a while since I've made a YouTube video, I know, and I'm sorry you guys, but uh, this year, this winter in particular, I'm going to be really concentrating on that and really getting some videos out for you guys. And by the way, I got myself a nice little present. This here is the Strike Master Lithium 40 Volt. Picked it up there two weeks ago, and... Uh, this thing is a beast. I already just checked the ice and uh, this video will be also the ice report as I've done one at least every year just before the season just to kind of give people an update and although I say what the ice report is on the lake that I'm on right now it's not like that for every other lake so please be sure you check uh, the safety when it comes to ice fishing or even just being on ice because ice is never going to be the same as it ever is going to be but I want to test this out though this thing just rocks and right on the shore here I'm maybe about I don't know about 50 yards offshore and with the ice here and when I check the ice it's roughly around 10 inches off just off the shore I can't touch the bottom of the ice like okay so my thumbs on top I it's probably about an inch past my middle finger here, so that's quite thick. But what I'm going to do is I want to keep testing out this Strike Master auger. This is my first time actually using it, so I'm really happy with it so far. And we're just going to keep walking out a bit, and I'm just going to be uh, checking. I'm going to be like doing like about two or three steps, drill a hole, another two three steps, drill another hole. Just to test this thing out, but also check the ice thickness, because this weekend... I'm going to be doing some ice fishing, uh, probably either maybe tomorrow or Saturday, we'll see. But yeah, let's give it a check. Well guys, that is a lot of holes and that I was able to go quite far. Oh, I don't know how far that is, but for this auger, like this auger is actually incredible. How fast it drills, it's crazy. And it's lightweight, that's the best part as well. Like, was about almost 10 inches of ice in less than three four seconds and it's drilled almost my whole life I was run running a hand dogger nope don't have to do that no more Hoo -hoo. but anyways though like I said you guys though please check the ice before you go on the, out on the lake and personally for me uh, there's a lot of gutsy people out there and they'll go ice fishing at around two three inches of ice no thank you but uh, my preferred is around between five to eight inches for starting ice fishing so and it's good black ice too which is the most solid ice you can get and uh, yeah everybody stay safe make sure you wear, wear your ice picks uh, some kind of floating device on your on you just in case if you do fall through and uh, there's a few videos that I'll put as, a, as a, in the link in the description down below uh, there's one video on uncut angling uh, he did a where well, he actually fell through the ice and uh, he did a lot of good safety tips on that so I'll put that in a link so you guys can watch that. It's a very good video, very informative. 
But anyways, so we shall see you guys this weekend. Stay safe out there. We'll uh, take, well, yeah, and we'll check up on you guys next time. You know, in the 2023-2024 ice fishing season. See ya.